Distinguished participants, data experts, users, producers, ladies and gentlemen, it's an honor and pleasure for me to welcome you to the seventh Global Forum on Gender Statistics and to address such a group of high-level experts on gender issues and gender statistics. Although I'm not able to join you in person today, I have full confidence that the United Nations Statistics Division is well represented by my trusted colleagues from the Social and Gender Statistics section. I would like to start by thanking and expressing our sincere gratitude to the government of Japan for hosting this event, for its financial contribution and experts' participation in the forum. In particular, I would like to thank our colleagues in the Ministry of Internal Affairs and Communications who have made this forum possible with their incredible support. We hold this forum every two years, and thanks to all of you, it has evolved into the world's leading event to discuss gender issues and gender statistics. In particular, since the adoption of the 2030 Agenda for Sustainable Development, the Global Gender Statistics Forum has become the platform for sharing best practices, to address the many challenges countries face to meet the ambitious SDGs gender requirements, including a standalone goal on gender equality and 80 SDG indicators relevant for gender analysis. Furthermore, integrating a gender dimension into the production, analysis, dissemination and communication of all areas of statistics and addressing persistent obstacles to women's and girls' full potential call for a multi-stakeholder dialogue. To this end, I'm happy to report that this forum succeeded in bringing together gender statisticians and gender experts from national, regional and international statistical offices, other government agencies, international organizations, academia, civil society, private sector, and the donor community. Over the next three days, the forum will review outstanding gender data gaps while highlighting progress achieved since we last met in Helsinki two years ago. Dear colleagues, let me restate UNSD's firm commitment to leading the development of gender statistics and monitoring progress towards gender equality globally since the early 1980s. This commitment finds its most re recent expression in the upcoming finalization of our methodological work under the Evidence and Data for Gender Equality, the EDGE project, that developed and tested methodologies to measure asset ownership and entrepreneurship from a gender perspective. I am proud to announce that we will soon start implementing the Phase 2 of the EDGE project, whose objective is to modernize time-use surveys and improve capacity at the national level to produce comprehensive and internationally comparable time-use data. I would also like to highlight UNSD's flagship publication, The World's Women which has provided solid and objective evidence on the status of women compared to men worldwide since 1991. In the context of innovating and to reflect the evolving needs of users of gender statistics, the next report, due in 2020, will be drafted in consultation with multi-stakeholders, including, hopefully, many of you in this room. Finally, you may know that UNSD has been the Secretariat of the Interagency and Expert Group on Gender Statistics since its creation in 2006. This is a group of subject matter experts from national, regional and international statistical offices and other stakeholder agencies who just held their 12th meeting and are with us at the forum here. Let me take this opportunity to thank the members of this group for guiding the Global Gender Statistics Programme, mandated by the United Nations Statistical Commission, and for coordinating gender statistics initiatives across agencies for so many years. 
Dear colleagues, we at the United Nations Statistics Division are honored to serve the global statistical community and remain committed to fostering the development of gender statistics in line with SDG's requirement while promoting data modernization and innovation as well as collaboration among partners at the national, regional and international levels. We look forward to working with you all to promote the advancement of gender statistics programs for accurate, inclusive, disaggregated, open and interoperable gender data that are trusted by all data producers and users in order to achieve sustainable development and better lives for all. I wish you all a fruitful discussion and I'm very much looking forward to learning about your conclusions. Thank you very much.